Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I'm going to be going to buy a Christmas tree and some decorations. So I saw some really cute trees at Home Goods, and you probably saw it in my previous vlog. They were kind of expensive so I'm going to go see the trees at Target first and if I don't like none of those trees then I'll um go to home goods and get the tree that I want but I really want a tree with flocking and I think I want to do like a new theme for my Christmas tree um this is my first time buying and decorating a Christmas tree since living on my own and I've lived on my own since for probably like I don't know like a long time now since I was in college so yeah um I always used to think that like you know I wanted to wait until like I had a reason to decorate for Christmas like I knew I was gonna get gifts and stuff but this year I've really been in the holiday mood I don't know why I think cuz I'm bored um so I'm going to buy a Christmas tree and decorate and I ordered Christmas pajamas I'm gonna wear my pajamas and I got the chocolate spoons with the marshmallows on it I'm gonna make hot chocolate and I'm going to pretend that I'm a child again so so come with me to get a Christmas tree finding the right words to express you in love it's a feel it's an addiction we want and need okay so I'm at Target and I'm not really seeing many Christmas trees. Like, they're small. Um, this is what I'm seeing. Let me start from the beginning of the aisle. They have these tabletop trees. Um, like, little Christmas tree ornament things that you put, like, on the TV stand. Christmas colored blanket. This. I have a wreath already that I gotta hang up. Um, I have this wreath too, but this isn't really a Christmas wreath. I put that up in the spring. They have this thing that says Noel. That's cute. If I had a house, this is a candle. This is a candle holder, and they have like this little tree and christmas candles on which i already have oh look this is cute like a christmas countdown garland poop ball garlands yeah it's not really doing it for me they do have some nice baskets to hold like blankets for the winter time i like that one that's really cute um they have more 25 days till Christmas stockings. Um, they have like mini trees, Christmas pillows. Yeah, not really feeling it. I do want a neutral sock, but I don't really like these, they look cheap. So I'm going to go to Home Goods and Marshalls. Oh, here's some other Christmas stuff they have, y'all. This is another owl. More candles, more baskets, wreaths with pine cones on them. I guess these are like tree fillers. If you have a fake thin tree, that'll be good to put stuff in it. Throw blankets, more stockings. I'm not sure if it's just this Target because my friend said she got a tree at Target, but they don't have any Christmas trees. So, going to Home Goods. <laughs> so, I just met this lady who overheard me talking, saying that I was looking for a Christmas tree. She said that they did have Christmas trees, but they sold out. Um, she told me to go to Home Depot. She said that they have the best uh, Christmas trees for the best prices, but close to Home Depot to me is like 20 minutes. And I don't feel like driving that far because it's traffic right now. It's 5.57. Y'all know LA, the traffic is crazy. So 20 minutes will turn into an hour. She also said Michaels. So I'm going to go to Michaels first before I go to Home Goods because it's one like 
right near me that um, Michael's is actually next to Home Goods. So I'm gonna go in there first. But in the meantime, between time, Target has some really cute pajamas. Y'all saw, I put these on my last vlog. These Christmas socks with the black Santa Claus. So today I'm actually gonna buy a pair because I like socks and slippers. I have like a little drawer of socks and slippers because I don't like walking barefoot in a house. But let me show you guys the Christmas pajamas in case you guys want matching pajamas this year from Target. So they have like the Christmas t-shirts. They have the matching tops and bottoms. Play it robe. The Spanish Christmas shirts, Feliz Navidad. Yeah, they have a bunch. They have the plaid, um, the flannel top and bottom for men's and women's. So get y'all matching pajamas at Target. And they even have Christmas dog clothes. Let me get one for Gigi. I'm low-key annoyed. These socks are $9. The dog Christmas pajama thing is $10. But I didn't plan on spending $20 on stuff that's not Christmas trees. I just feel like those socks are too much, but I'm still gonna get it, so. You guys, this girl is ratchet as hell, but I like her music. My nigga did me wrong. All right. All right. Looking like a bad bitch round all these rich niggas. I be looking like a bad bitch round these white folks. <laughs> okay, so I'm at Michael's, and if they don't have what I'm looking for, Marshalls is next door, and then Home Goods is right there. So I'm gonna go in here first and check out the trees. It's 60 degrees in LA. Like it feels good. Like you cannot wear a jacket, but then if you wear a jacket, you don't look silly. I hate in between weather like this, but um, Michaels has a sell. They have acorns for $3.99. Oh, and they have glitter on them. I think I'm gonna get some of these. These are pretty to go in a tree. Maybe like two. Yeah, this should be cool. I'll just get one. And then they have like these plain wreaths for $5.99. Um, they have like garland for $7.99, but this looks cheap. Like, look at that. That, that looks like dollar store. So we're not getting that. Oh my God, y'all. They got 60% off these clear bulbs. I've been seeing people get the clear bulbs and then put like paint in them. Oh my God, that's so cute. But I don't really feel like doing a DIY project. Like I've been seeing it on TikTok, like say you want like an all new matte aesthetic. They've been buying like matte paint or like brown paint and then fill in the clear bulbs with them. That's really, really cute. Yeah, I think about it, but I don't feel like doing DIY. And, oh, these are so pretty. Pink. Okay, before I get a cart, let me see what they got. Okay. Oh, that lady knew what she was talking about. And this tree at Home Goods wasn't even this wide, and it was two hundred dollars plus. So I'm glad I came here first. Um, let's see if they got some with flocking on it. I really want to one with flocking on it. Okay, this is a thin one for a hundred dollars. I don't think that's bad. I mean, I don't really have gifts to put under it anyway, but this is pretty. I think I'm gonna get this one because my apartment is too small for all the big stuff. Let me see what else they got. This is $200, I'm guessing. Oh, this comes with 500 clear lights. This one is $209. These are some full trees. This one comes with 500 multicolor lights. These prices are way better than the ones at Home Goods. This is $219. I don't think that's bad, because look how big and how full this tree is. This tree is seven point five feet tall pre-lit and it has flocking on it 
for $200. And it's full. It doesn't look like thin. Okay, these trees are way better than um, Home Goods. I'm glad I didn't go there. This one is $300. Honestly, this is plain with white lights for $300. I would rather get this one. It's the same height, it's 7.5. But this one has flocking on it. It just looks better. The flocking is pretty out of stock. Okay, they got some really nice trees here. So if you guys didn't get your trees yet, come to Michael's or try Home Depot. I didn't feel like driving to Home Depot like the lady said, but um, they might have even better prices. Oh, look at this one. This is $2.29. Look at the pines on this. This is pretty. This is beautiful. This looks really real. This one is called Jasper Cashmere Tree, number 121. If I needed a wide tree, I would probably get this. I like the, um, this looks way more realistic than this. This is beautiful. This one is 119, multicolor. Eh, it's smaller, but it's pretty full. For 119, that's not bad. This is 89.99. Oh, look, y'all. Okay, oh my God. Should I spend $100 and get the one with flocking or should I spend $89 and get the thin one with the, with the leaves that I like? I really do like this. Okay, I gotta phone a friend and get their advice. If some more little thin ones, seventy-four dollars, and this one is one twenty-nine. This comes with lights too for eighty-nine dollars. Okay, let me see if the one with flocking comes with lights. Here's some more trees. I don't know why this ugly tree is four hundred nineteen dollars. It looks like dollar store leaves. They look so plastic. They have a fifty-dollar tree. Okay. So this one that I was originally looking at is $100 and it does come with lights flocking. I probably mentioned it, but I forgot that fast. So should I get this one? Or... This one. Hmm, decisions, decisions. Okay, so I just sent pictures of both trees to my friends and they said get the flock tree. So I'm getting a flock pencil tree number 181 in case anybody else wants to go to Michael's and buy it. Um, oh, it says that the regular price is $169, but it's only $99. Woo, I'm so happy. Because yes, that was like the price at Home Goods, and I just wasn't feeling it. So I'm going to ask them to get this tree for me. And now I'm going to look at some ornaments. Okay, so now that I figured out a tree, I'm grabbing a basket. So far, I just have the pine cones. I have like the silver glitter on it. But I really want to stick to like a neutral. I'm not sure if I want to do neutral as in like a pinkish neutral or like brown and tan. But I want to do like neutral colors. Let me show you guys all the stuff that Michaels has. So they have a bunch of lights. They have a lot of stuff. I never thought to come to Michael's for Christmas stuff. This is new to me if y'all been coming here, but this is exciting. I like this. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything over here. Little reindeers and stuff. Garland. Okay. 60% off garland. Oh wow, y'all, this sale don't end at Michael's till December 6th. So if y'all need Christmas stuff, make sure y'all go to Michael's. They got all this stuff, this cute stuff. So my wreath kinda looks like that. I'll show you guys. Oh, I'm loving it. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. This is cute, I like this. See, I think I wanna do colors like this, like, the acorn with like goldish and tan. Hmm. Oh, that looks cheap. Okay, let's go to the next owl. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, this looks like kitty ornaments over here. All right, where's the cute stuff? Oh, oh my God, this is like Christmas heaven. Look, they got the big round, they got all different shapes of the um, the clear balls, the big round ones. Outside, the ones that were 60% off, they were like flat circle ones. 50% off. This is like heaven. These prices are so good. I need to get a ribbon for the tree. This is so fun. I can't wait till I have like kids and a big house and I just do all this Christmas stuff just because I want to and lie to my kids and tell them about Elf on the Shelf and if they be bad and just do all the Christmas stuff. I love Christmas and make gingerbread houses and bake cookies and um, wake them up early in the morning to open presents. Oh, Christmas. Okay, this is some more stuff they have. Maybe I won't get a stocking since I'm getting an actual tree. Okay. Okay, so this is more ornaments. All of these ornaments are kind of like DIY. Again, the big uh, ornaments that you put paint in. I really don't feel like all of that. So I think I just might get the ornaments from Home Goods. I'm gonna go see what they have. Yeah, if I absolutely can't find any like for like what I'm going for, then I'll come back. Um, it looks like each ornament individually is $1.99. And these were the ones, the flat circle ones that were outside for 60% off. They're like this, they look like a disc. Oh, all of them are 60% off. They even have like these really large ones, which can be cute. So I'll just get the tree and then go to Home Goods. <laughs> I like these, but yeah, it's not enough. Let's see what else they have. Oh, this is pretty. I at least need to get some ornaments tonight. This is ridiculous. Where is the stuff? And I don't want to just like buy stuff because like I'm trying to get stuff tonight, but like that's what it's about to give. So tomorrow, I'm just gonna go to Hobby Lobby because this is not working out. Um, everything is sold out. And plus I'm on call for work tomorrow um, up in Corona, which is an hour away. So I might have better luck outside of the city finding um, ornaments. Okay, so I just got home. So I'm going to put the tree right here because, again, y'all know my space is small. Um, if it doesn't look right right here, then I'm going to move it to next to like my credenza right here. And then I don't know what I'll do with this plant because this apartment is small. I moved my little blanket holder right here so it limits my walkway. But yeah, this tree looks super easy to put up. Um, by the way, I have my... Autumn Spice Candle. My cousin actually makes this, y'all. And it smells really, 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 really good. I'm not just saying that because she's my cousin. Because she has another candle that I don't really care for. But I really like candles that, like, the scent takes up the room. I don't like light candles. But this one smells really good. It's called Autumn Spice. So, now I done put on my pajamas. Um, after I put this tree together, I'm going to wash my face and go to bed. But... Let me record myself putting this tree together. It looks really easy. It's only like three pieces and then this uh, holder right here. And each piece has like a number on it. Like it has a tag. I saw the tag 
see look it has like this tag like number one this is the first piece and then i think this is the third piece and then i think this is the second um so yeah it's really simple to put together so i'm gonna record myself putting it together and fluff it out plug it in i didn't get the ornaments yet um because everything in my area was sold out so tomorrow i'm gonna go buy the ornaments and in my next video i'll do decorating a tree and how i decorated it and everything else Okay, y'all, so this is what the tree looks like all put together. I have to find something to cover the holder at the bottom, but it looks really good put together. I can't. I don't think it looks like too much because it's very slim. I think it looks good in this space. I don't think I'm going to move it to the hall, um, but this is what it looks like. Simple, cute, thin Christmas tree, and this is the flocking. I love the white flocking, make it look like snow. Um, this is the bottom part. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I might just put some like a blanket I need to get a blanket to put around there or uh, I don't know because the Christmas tree uh, Skirt that I saw it was way too big for this Slim tree, so maybe I'll get on Amazon and see if I can find a skirt for a slim tree But this is the final result. I love it. It's so cute. Oh And I changed the reef on the back of my door so this is my wintertime wreath. I have a wreath for every season, except spring, but my wreath for spring is like all grass. It's like grass leaves that I saw in Target. Remember I told you guys I had that? I use that for summer and spring, but this spring I'm gonna get a really cute one that's flowery. But this is my winter wreath. I've had this for a few years. It's actually from Target. And it's so cute. It's like flocked um, pine cones and uh, leaves. Just kind of like my tree. This is some of my summer reef that I was talking about stuck in it, but this is the reef. It's so cute. Yeah, so, okay guys, Next. until next video.